What's up guys, I got a quick track review for you today. Today I'm talking about the new Judas Priest song, Firepower. Judas Priest is one of my all-time favorite bands, coming out with this new record, Firepower, in March. So far we have two singles, the first one, Lightning Strikes, the new one, the title track, Firepower, just came out the other day. And man, have these singles been, you know, great so far. I've been pretty excited about them. I was a fan of their last record, Redeemer of Souls, that featured uh, Richie Faulkner on guitar, uh, the first time stepping in for K.K. Downing, who had left the band. You know, Halford and the band had said in interviews that Richie really kind of re-energized them, got them excited to write music again, got them excited to continue to perform. Even though they had done sort of a farewell tour that was later rebranded as a farewell to world tours, uh, but nonetheless, you know, having Richie and the band really kick things into gear again. Uh, and Redeemer was a pretty good album. My problems with that album were mostly with the production. I thought it was a little weak. The drums in particular didn't have a very strong sound for me. Uh, Halford's vocals were sometimes getting lost in the mix, sometimes just having this weird glaze over them. Nonetheless, it was a pretty good album. I thought it did a pretty good job of taking from different parts of the band's career. And it seems like so far with these new tracks, uh, that's where they seem to be going. But overall, I gotta say, I think the production sounds much more crisp. Once again, the band is working with Tom Alam, who they have not worked with since Ram It Down, uh, which came out in 1988. But Alam had been around for a very pinnacle run of great Priest records. Uh, I'm a big fan of the early stuff, but you know, Tom Alam came in for British Steel, went all the way through to Ram It Down. Huge, huge classics in there, you know, British Steel being an obvious one, really broke them through in the United States. But Screaming for Vengeance, my personal favorite, Defenders of the Faith, just a huge, amazing album. As far as the track Firepower goes, I feel like you're getting a nice mix of different eras, like I was saying, that they did on Redeemer. But whereas Redeemer kind of, like, each individual song could be, you know, affixed to a certain era, here on Firepower, and to an extent on Lightning Strikes, I feel like they're mixing it all together into one whole, and it's making just a really huge and a balanced sound. Firepower sounds like a song that could have easily been on the Painkiller album as far as the heaviness, the explosive chorus, the ripping double bass pedal, and the high shrieking vocals of Halford in the chorus area, but at the same time there's elements of their past work in here. The verses take on a sort of power metal approach, uh, Rob's vocals are sounding you know, incredibly strong, uh, a lot stronger than they had on the previous record. Uh, there's just a lot more like oomph to it. And then you get moments like the little breakdown that kind of bookends the guitar solo here. Scott Travis on the drums going into a sort of rhythmic type section with the toms. The way the riff rides over it and it just creates a really nice groove, especially the way Halford's vocals come in with it as well. Uh, that kind of grooviness, you know, that reminds me of something you might have heard off of British Steel. Which I, I think I had seen in an interview Halford saying that, you know, he would best describe this album as a mix of Painkiller and British Steel. So actually hearing that, you know, be done pretty effectively, has me very excited for the album. The guitar solos on here are really great. From what I could tell, I think I saw on Twitter, uh, Richie really taking the lead on here. He adds his own kind of flair to Priest, it's his own unique kind of style, uh, can be heard here, but you know, he, he knows what the band is going for and what the fans really love from this band. Uh, so he's able to pull that out of the guys, you know, this far into their career. So overall, a really strong track. I liked Lightning Strikes as well. It had a Hell Patrol kind of swing to it. Uh, some pretty memorable riffs going on here. And again, another great performance from Halford. Uh, I personally felt that some of the uh, vocal delivery and the melodies that were being kind of infused with that reminded me of, you know, somewhere in their mid-80s uh, career. You know, maybe something off of Defenders of the Faith. So like I said, it's cool to hear this mix of eras going on. And it's only been two tracks so far, so so it's pretty exciting. I'm pretty hyped up for this album, uh, one of my most anticipated of the year. So yeah, looking forward to the record. I'll certainly be reviewing it. And uh, let me know what you think of the song Firepower in the comments. And uh, as always, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Yeah.